Hey, what's up guys? TS Games here, and welcome back to Amnesia The Dark Descent. Uh, oh, my little brother was playing, how fun. Okay, well, let's continue, shall we? I can't even remember where we were. It's been so long since I played last. Anywho, it doesn't really make much of a difference. Well, this is a boring loading screen, so I'll get back to you. Alright, you guys, I'm back. Okay, there are the rest puzzles on the floor. I think we were supposed to go through that door. I think it's about time things really started getting scary. Oh. Ew. Oh. 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 Ew. Okay. Oh. Oh. I don't... I don't like that. Some sort of organic tissue blocks the path to the refinery. Can it be dissolved? Ew. 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 No. Ew. No. 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 Just no. That's disgusting. If I accidentally keep blowing into the microphone, I'm sorry. I don't exactly have a pop filter. So why did it want me to run? I think that might be a bad thing. What? You'll be okay. I'll, I'll I'll come back to you later. Tabularium. Where's Harper when you need him? Lantern. Here, lantern. Um. Crystal clear. Crystal clear. No. I think I, that's where I came from. I don't think I need to be in the archives. Let's see. Okay. That's okay. Stop it! Laboratory wine cellar. Laboratory or wine cellar? Left or right? Left or right? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger by the. Oh, let's go in the laboratory. Let's go! Actually, oops. The other children cheered him on. His name voiced in a steadily rising pace, urging him to do it. Am I really doing this? The young boy thought and struck his victim. I wish you guys could have seen the little thing there. Thing going on there. This is getting real scary. Real fast. I didn't think it was going to be that bad. But we don't have Harper with us. <gasps> this is, no, Daniel! You're okay. I would really like to have Harper with us. Last hundred bucks. Let's go all the way down here. Ah, uh, okay. I don't. I I don't like this. I'm not looking down there again. Whoa! Whoa! Okay. Uh, uh, there should be more Kubrat. Let me see. Let me see. And one part Aqua Fortress. of a chimney to properly vent the fumes from my most recent experiments has taken its toll on many of my 
less stable ingredients in the storage. Some seem unaffected, but many are stained by the fumes and will be difficult to salvage. I shall do what I can to move them to the mine. Four different chemicals. Oh, lantern oil. I think I'll need that. Yeah, because I think I'm running low. Cool. <coughs> Every time I sneeze, my head goes blah. Every time. Is this a chemical? How about you? Are you a chemical? Guess not. Third attempt to produce artificial light. Light enough in here that I don't need my lantern. This is scary. Really, really scary. All right, let's go to the wine cellar next. If I must. Oh, hey. It can be dissolved with some sort of acid we make by combining those four ingredients. But we need to find those four ingredients first. Those four ingredients are in the wine cellar. But I need the key in order to get in there. Tears were beginning to well in his eyes as he received his first kick to the stomach. Hazel remained hidden in fear she too would be punished. Well, that's encouraging. I don't understand. So at least we know their rose petals are not the one. going. Okay, so I have not been in here. Well, no, I'm in light right now. What's this? A slight headache. All is good. Oh. Oh, sorry about that. I'm back. Okay, so this says rare books. Should we, like, trash them? Oh. 16th of May, oh. 1839. The unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. 
When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. An interesting story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. Wow. That's no bug. Go away. Go away. Do I dare open this door? What's it say? Catalogs. I don't want to. Something's off about this room, but I don't have any tinder boxes. Study? Okay. I don't want to go into the study. Study sounds like a bad place. A really, really bad place. Okay, this looks fully lit. Oh, hey, chair. These are some big paintings. Hey, Jesus is a crucifixion. What? Anyway, it's Jesus is a crucifixion again. Okay, so I looked at Jesus without getting killed. history. Of course. I don't know, is there another entrance here? A drawer. Nothing in those drawers. Alright, fine. I'll go into the stupid study. No, I won't. No, I won't. Oh! He's not on a scooter. He's playing the violin. Move chair. Alright. Okay, so Jesus is playing the violin in this picture. Oh, a tinderbox. Yay. Seventeenth of May, eighteen thirty-nine. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. 
Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. Go away! Yeah! We're drunk. Oh, no. Close. Cool. Why is there never anything good? over this bookshelf. I should probably be saving my... Oh. That's encouraging. What did I tell you? It's gonna burn out soon. It's gonna burn out soon. Let's see? Slight headache. I still have a chemistry pot. I still have to find that key. Where is that key? darkness. This is weird. Oh, the roof caved in. Okay. Hey, look, a window. can they just break it and leave? I would really, really like to do that right now. Here, chair. You're gonna have to protect me. That's hard for I haven't been in here. Harper's not here. Lantern oil. Okay. I don't need it now. Get up again. Oh. All right, chair. Come here. Follow you around. You're gonna have to follow. I'm gonna. Okay, sorry. Sorry, I dropped you. But it's cool. Okay. You. I haven't neglected you. I just needed to put you down while I opened this drawer. Why is there nothing good? There's never anything good. Cool. Not cool. Is this still four plans? Launcher. Wow. What did I tell you? Much of the castle is old and hasn't been tended to Get for out centuries. Of here. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk everything will cave in on us. Especially downstairs. Sorry, you missed part of that. Anyway... Well... Basically, said something about a shadow arriving and yada yada yada. And they need to reinforce weak structures and get servants working on it. Tinderbox! Okay, I don't need this right now. Uh, it's empty again.
Here, 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 tinderbox. Okay, let's read this. No, 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 Daniel, get up. Get up, get up and read the note. 17th of May, 1839. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. Oh. I had to push myself toward the enchanting light. Cool. It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. Did I touch it? I'm gonna touch it. I reached out, closing it in my hands. Like yeah. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and in Possible geometry. Okay. The next the thing I can remember bad. is the grating sound of stone being lifted. The voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety. And grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar what did I tell you. Well, that was interesting. Well, it looks like we're gonna have to end that here for today. My cousin wants me to go play Left 4 Dead. I'm gonna record that too, by the way, so... Uh, just, just stick to it. I'm gonna check what's up in these drawers. Hey, look, a tinderbox. Grab that. Book. No one cares about you. Absolutely nothing. Alright, so... I guess that means I will see you on the next one. Alright, bye! Because Brandon can't turn on the report time because that's sign, you know, Brandon can't. And I'm back! A broom! I love brooms! Oh. Guess Show me some of my best friends. Okay.